I'm Gareth Dixon, I'm Vice Principal of Finance and Resources at Craven College. So we offer a range of vocational qualifications across the Craven area, um, as well as uh, remote sites that we have at Leeds Bradford Airport and a specialist uh, high needs education centre in Ripon, known as Ripon Evolve. We've invested in a complete uh, desktop refresh for all of our student devices, um, which resulted in over 400 desktop positions being changed, uh, as well as issuing laptops uh, to all of our staff. This is something that the staff didn't have previously. Previously it was fixed desk positions, um, sharing of machines. Um, so now every staff member who needs one uh, has got a laptop or mobile device. The equipment that we had uh, was on average seven years old. Um, as a consequence, we were suffering from poor performance, low satisfaction rates from our, our students, um, inefficiencies, some machines were taking up to 15, 20 minutes to load up each day. Um, and that just was, was resulted in a, a much, a, an aging IT estate that heavily needed investment. So we'd worked with Apogee previously um, for our print contract, um, but we went out to tender through the CPC framework, um, which we then discovered Apogee were on the framework of which we were looking to uh, put the tender out through. It allowed us a, a proven route to market um, for us to access this, uh, what we've, we've now got across the college. Um, and it was something that we knew we could rely on. Um, we had the benefit of our previous uh, working relationship with Apogee on the print side. Um, but through the tender process, we discovered Apogee could offer the same level of service on our devices as well, um, which is really helping us as well, that we can link our print and our devices as one through one relationship. So the education sector is continuously using technology, um, more so in recent years, particularly with COVID. Um, the amount of remote learning uh, that now happens has increased. Um, so having a reliable technology base on which to operate from has been proven essential. And we're finding that every curriculum area that we, we work in has got an increasing dependency upon technology. Um, so this investment was actually absolutely key to our success going forward. Every course will be uh, touched in some shape or form, whether that be through the classrooms that we've deployed the equipment in, whether it be in the Learning Resource Centre, where we carry out our directed study sessions, um, and also through the, the staff that are teaching those students with the technology that we've now given those staff, um, is enabling them to provide a much more digitally immersive uh, curriculum. The team were brilliant, um, incredibly flexible, very accommodating, understood our restrictions around timetabling that we have. Obviously, we're fairly busy um, during the uh, college day, so we're willing to work around that, that day, going into rooms when they were empty, and working through our holiday period, which often coincides with when a lot of people want to take holiday with, with their families. So overall, very flexible approach and a positive can-do attitude. Uh, staff have been overwhelmed with the quality of the product, particularly after the um, underinvestment uh, that we'd experienced for many, many years. Um, as I mentioned earlier, seven years worth of seven-year-old equipment um, wasn't performing. Um, as a consequence, we've seen a significant reduction in the number of queries or tickets, as we call them, coming through our IT help desk in the region of 85% reduction uh, off the back of that. And from the most importantly, the student side of things, we saw a 15% increase in student satisfaction with the equipment. Um, and this was whilst the rollout was happening. Um, so that was, it's now at 91% satisfaction with the equipment. So we've got a few uh, options that we're currently exploring. One is um, looking at offering uh, laptops to our students. So that's through, probably through two main channels. One is availability of quality laptops on site. Um, to supplement the desktop positions that we've had. Uh, and the other way is uh, looking at options to provide a laptop um, purchasing solution for our students. So if they choose to buy a laptop of their own, we can look to, to offer them a, a device uh, in partnership with Apogee. Another solution that we'll be um, putting in place is a laptop safe or laptop locker. Um, it's a bit like a, an Amazon locker, which will allow staff and students to be able to go and access uh, a laptop within the college's reception area for use on, on site. Um, that will provide a 
tracked system when they log the laptop out, when they log the laptop back in um, and reduce the reliance on staff being present to be able to issue those laptops. Um, so I'd say two, two main aspects. One is the quality of the equipment that we've received. Um, absolutely fantastic quality for me, the HP laptops and on all of the equipment that we've been provided as part of the, the contract. Uh, and the other thing I'd say is the, the service that we've, we've received from Apogee. Um, the deployment team were absolutely fantastic, very flexible, um, very approachable. Um, I can feel like I can pick up the phone to our contract director at any point and, and speak to him about any problems that we've got and get them resolved quickly.